Knuckles are up. Just picked up Super Mario Bros. I mean Super Mario 64. Mario Kart Star Fox and Smash for 30 bucks. Later. Monster Jam Path of Destruction and Deca Sports 2 most likely this will be sold before I make the video but as we all know um, this game goes for about 35-40 bucks so I got these two for 5 bucks altogether not a bad deal later and the sale over here it's Friday by the way a PS2 Silver Slim, Def Jam Fight for New York, all that was 10 bucks. The tag sale over here, just hit big and got right on time because somebody came right after me. All kinds of stuff. Everything was 28 bucks. Biggest thing, Dragon Ball Z, Burakai Tenkaichi. <laughs> Tenkaichi, three. The sale over here. Just a PS3 in box with Catherine and a few other games. Everything for 50 bucks. Later. And the tax sale over here. That's why you always have to ask, no matter what, on a Sunday. All this stuff. Basically, I asked any video games. At first, he said no. Then all of a sudden, he said, "Wait, you need? You mean PlayStation?" I said, "Sure." He comes back with a bin full of stuff. And all that was in there. Including Shattered Hand. All of it. All of it for 40 bucks. And 64, a whole bunch of games. Mario Kart. Later. We'll explain later. Later. Alright guys, these are the pickups for the second week of June. It was a very good week. So I will try to go as fast as possible. We'll start with thrift stores, do tax sales and whatever comes in between. Um, first thing, it's a wave bird. Very good condition. For three bucks, it also had the receiver, which is obviously very necessary. Um, next thing will be NCAA Basketball 10. It came in a different case. I was able to replace it sold already for a real good price and this was three bucks at a goodwill at savers picked up 007 the world is not enough for 2.99 and dynamite heady for 2.99 then we will go with the only pickup that i have from the flea market it was a game boy with this um rechargeable battery it's, the lady wanted 10 i got her down to eight but that's pretty much all i can do tested it it's working fine so that's cool then we'll do tax sales we'll do the tax sales on friday one thing that i can't show is the four games so the n64 games that i picked up on offer up they were star fox mario 64 mario kart and Smash Bros for 30 bucks. They were all sold, so that's why I can't show them. Um, we'll do the first set of tax sales on Friday, which is this. Picked up a PS2 Slim Silver. It looked in really good condition. Unfortunately, it's not reading the discs, so that's not cool. It also came with two controllers. And then 187 Ride or Die and Def Jam Fight for NYC. So at the end of the day, I got all my money back and more by just that game. We'll do tax sales on Saturday next. The stuff that I don't think I have on tape is this Super Mario Galaxy was for a buck. Grand Theft Auto 5 was also a buck. 
Then we will do this. It's a TI 83 plus. That was five bucks. It already sold for 30, so can't complain about that. We will do the first sale on Saturday, which actually was really good. Um, went there. The lady had all this stuff. She said she mentioned in the ad there were going to be some games. So when I got there early, um, was lucky and got a lot of stuff really, really cheap. I will go through it as fast as I can. Basically, every single game that you will see that for the DS and the Game Boy is 50 cents. The for the PlayStation, they were a buck. And then the other ones, they say five, but I was able to get everything for 28 bucks. The first game is Crash, Bandicoot, second is Jugio for the Game Boy Advance, Dragon Ball Z, Taiketsu, Dragon Ball Z, The Legend of Goku 2, Crash, Entranced, all 50 cents, like I said, really good deal. Dragon Ball C, the collectible card game. Obviously, the young lady like collect, you know, um, Dragon Ball C, Spyro, Season of Ice, The Legend of Zelda, Oracle of Ages for fifty cents. Dragon Ball C, Super Warriors. Picked up another Kirby's Dream Land two. My second one in like two weeks. She had two of the Wario Land 2's. Those were also 50 cents. So she had two of those Wario Lands. She also had Wario Land, the regular one. I guess it's Super Mario World 3. Then she had Super Mario Land. Super Mario Land 2. Game Boy Pocket for two bucks, which is an excellent deal with battery cover. Game Boy Advance for another two bucks. Another good pickup. And a Game Boy Color Purple, two bucks with battery cover. Here are the PlayStation games. Um, Inuyasha, A Feudal Fairy Tale. That was a buck. Rampage World Tour. That was also a buck. Spyro, Year of the Dragon, also a dollar. Spyro, Ripter's Rage, a buck. Spyro, the Dragon. And Crash Bandicoot, all oh, for a buck a piece. Um, Inuyasha, Feudal, Combat. Never seen this game before. I picked it up thinking that maybe it was something, but it really wasn't. So it's gonna die. Elemental Force. Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 2, which is a decent price game, and base, the best the best game of the lot by far is Budokai Tenkaichi 3. All that for 28 bucks, which is fantastic. The next thing will be the Sunday tax sales. Sunday usually I don't pick up much, but I went to three sales, four sales. And three of them hit. Um, first thing, first sale that I hit was this PS3 in box. With controller. And I believe it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine games for 50 bucks. The games were Grand Theft Auto V, Catherine. Dishonored, Rocksmith, Red Dead Redemption, Un Dead Nightmare, Skyrim, Batman Arkham City, Heavy Rain, and God of War Ascension. All that for 50 bucks, which is a really good price. Then the best sale of the week, and you know, basically my best sale that I ever had for um, older games. Went there. It was just pretty much just little kid stuff. I asked if he had any video games. He said no. 
And when I started walking away, he kind of said, hold on, you, you mean like PlayStation, like that great PlayStation? I said, sure. If you have any games, I will buy them if, you know, if they're a decent price. He comes back and he comes back with a tub. He opens up the tub and to my surprise, he had a whole bunch of games. And we'll go through everything for everything that you're about to see. I paid 40 bucks altogether. NHL Face Off 98. PlayStation, Gran Turismo, Twisted Metal, two copies of Twisted Metal, Nightmare Creatures, Nice for Speed, Oddworld, Gex, Resident Evil 2, Crash 2, Crash Bandicoot. And the best game out of the PlayStation stuff was Breath of Fire. But that wasn't all. He also had Nintendo and he had a Nintendo 64 with one remote. Every system basically has all the cables. I just don't put them all in the tape because it just takes forever. Um, for the Nintendo 64 he had Mission Impossible, Wayne Gretzky's Hockey, NHL 99. Iggy's Wrecking Balls, Super Mario 64, and Mario Kart. And he wasn't done. Um, he also had, for the NES, Dino Ricky, RC Pro-Am, Sky Shark, Sesame Street 1 through 3, Tiger Heli, Tetris 2, Captain Skyhawk, Yoshi's Cookie, Dr. Mario, Punch Outs, Super Mario Bros. 3, and the best two games is The Legend of Zelda Grey Cart, which I didn't have, and of course by far, like excellent, excellent pickup, Shatter Hand. It's a game that's easily over 50 bucks, basically paid 40 bucks for everything. It was a really, really surprising, and that's why you always have to ask, because you never know. I went there thinking I wasn't going to get anything on a Sunday, and all of a sudden, you end up with Shatter Hand in your hands for, you know, I can't, you know, maybe a buck a piece if you count every game that's there. Another really good week. Hopefully, they keep on going. It's been a really good, extremely good tax sale season for me. Um, hopefully you like the content. If you like the content, please like and subscribe. It would be greatly appreciated. And hopefully we have some more stuff next week. Later.